What have I done? What have I done? What's cracking laughing guys and girls? Hopefully everyone's doing all right. I know I am. First of all, I've got to give a huge shout out to all the new subscribers to the channel. I can't believe I've actually gained so many. I never said in my videos to hit that subscribe button and I'm not going to start doing that. Anyway, all I ask is that if you do like the stuff, leave a thumbs up and of course, comment down below. I'd love to know what your thoughts and opinions are regarding some of the trails I ride and some of the bike bits and pieces which I slap onto the bikes in order to dial them in. But with that being said, Today, we get to check out the newest upgrade I've done to the Kinevo. Check it out. This is the SR Suntour RUX Downhill Slash 3 by 4 This is a 200mm travel, 38mm stanchion, 27.5 inch four. Yeah. Now let's be real, this is not exactly groundbreaking is it? I mean after all, there are so many people out there who have slapped triple crown forks onto their Canevo experts. We only have to look on YouTube and see Marshall Mullins has done it, Harry Main's done it. Hell, if you go onto EMTB forums right now, there is a dedicated thread of people who have done the exact same thing, whether it be putting a Rockshot Boxer on or a Fox 40. But the one thing which I can't help but wonder is, do they end up keeping their bikes in those configurations or do they revert them back to using the lyrics or something similar to that effect? I guess there's only one way to find out, right? I've got to be honest. The difference in terms of how this fork responds in conjunction with the rear, it is noticeable. That wasn't bad. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> the fork has a, uh, a finger block on it, doesn't it? Damn it, I can't even get a good time. Ah, the hell with it. Let's see what this thing like climbing. Jeez. Yeah, that was an eco mode as well. Oh, crap. All right, moment of truth. The bike like is heavy now. So even I'm gonna have to eventually play the game of high fight with this thing. Three, two, one, go. <sighs> Not bad. Not bad. Sorry guys, on your right. Nice one. Thank you, mate. All right then, some tools. Let's see how you do with a little bit of toughness. Stare challenge. <laughs> now that's what you want.
Okay, let's just be real. Let's be real right now. This bike is now running a triple crown fork and I'm about to do a technical climb. Just bear that in mind, ladies and gentlemen. E-bike or not, triple crown fork, technical climb. Let's see how it goes. Sorry, sorry. Ugh. Ugh. Sorry. Ugh. Sorry. Hey. <laughs> it's all right, don't worry. Come on. Known. I wasn't expecting so many dogs. Boss, give credit where credit is due. It did do it. It did do it. Okay, maybe I was a bit premature regarding the technical gradient of that climb. I mean, after all, it looks like the conditions have kind of well, the ground's firmed up, put it that way, unlike the last time when I hit it and I ended up having to be in like boost mode. I think I think I was in trail mode when I was doing that, which to be honest, considering that the, the weight of the bike has increased, I am somewhat surprised to find that the thing can still climb pretty effectively and efficiently. So, hmm, hmm. Gotta be honest, I do really like this thing. You're doing it for the descent. But let's find out just what this thing can do. Oh my days, yes. So much better. I would honestly go as far as to say that these forks actually complement the Olin's TT rear coil much better than the Lyric. But like I said, I am not saying that the Lyric is a crap fork, because it isn't. In fact, I have plans. I have plans for that Lyric. Believe me. Oh, thank you. Oh my days! Yes. Yes, this thing can descend. This thing can send it. 
all right guys that's gonna be me for now um opinions of the bike so far oh my days if i thought the bike was a weapon before dude it is like an instrument of destruction honestly adding an extra 20 mil onto the front has actually done the bike some proper decent benefit but at the same time further testing is required so i'm gonna have to take it to an environment which it will be able to cope but nonetheless if you like this type of stuff again hit that like button comment below and as i always say take it easy